like this one. I like this antivirus. What is this? Trojans? It just said that I had to use my antivirus. Why is it still here? Oh my gosh. What am I gonna do? I have a virus on my computer. <laughs> she fell for my virus. Now, I have her passport. Her driver's license, her social security card, and her credit card. And with all this information, I can now steal all her credit and her money. Stop! I'm from the Geek Herd. Don't put your credit card in, it's fraudulent! I'll save your computer if it kills me! Does anyone know what was wrong in that video? Correct! Onigua had already entered her information and her identity had already been stolen. Although asking Geek Herd to help remove the malware on her computer is helpful in preventing future Trojans, this is unhelpful in recovering from identity theft. Recovering from identity theft can be a long, stressful, and potentially expensive process. To start with damage control, Contact companies that have your account information, file a report so that the police has a record of the incident, and contact agencies such as the DMV and Social Security Administration and let them know what happened. Welcome to the Geek Herd Virus Prevention Program. My name is Agent Smith and I'll go ahead and take you on this tour. So go ahead, uh, open up your laptops, we're going to take some notes here. Uh, we're going to talk about emails, Facebook, MySpace, downloading and inappropriate websites. So our first one is Facebook and MySpace. Make sure that the people you're friending are your friends. Everything needs to be a trusted resource when you work on your computer. Also, the advertisements on the side of your page most likely aren't going to be safe. If it's flashing at you and telling you you won, please do not click on it. Second of all, we're going to go ahead and talk about emails. If you know that your friend is going to send you an email, great! But if they send you something with a subject that you're not very aware of and there's an attachment, go ahead and call them first, asking them if they sent you an email, making sure it's not a virus. Third of all, we're going to talk about downloading. Downloading is illegal and is a great way to get a virus. So go ahead and make sure that all of your resources you're getting your music from, like iTunes, Napster, Rhapsody, and Best Buy Mobile, make sure that they're um, legal and that you're paying for your music. And lastly, we'll talk about inappropriate websites. Obviously a great way to get a virus. So please, your Friday nights, spend them doing something else. Thank you for attending the Geek Herd Virus Prevention Program.